first intro to Kiddo's fishing adventures. Oh, we thought we'd do a 13 year anniversary in um, memorable style. It's been good. Are you going for a nice little hike? I'm just going for a nice little hike. So if I don't keep up, I'm so lost right now. As you can see, I am in the bush. I'm sitting down actually, I've just fallen over. We're walking that way and I have company, my wife Mel, hiding behind some branches there, he's following me. Um, we're hiking out to a ledge to camp tonight, it's getting on in the Arvo. I don't know if we'll fish this Arvo, but we're definitely fishing tomorrow morning. So um, yeah, we'll keep on blazing the trail. We're almost at the ledge. Just around here. I can, um, if you want to sit down and have a breather, I'll go drop my bag and come up and get your backpack after. Cause this bit's a bit sketchy. Just sit wherever you're comfortable here, there, there. Yep. I'm just going down and I'll just go through here and I'll be back up in a sec. <sighs> oh, there's a bit of a ledge down around here. So it's easy to go down that way, but there's like a real easy little corner to climb up for me anyway. Yeah. Um, you ready to go down? You just come down behind me and I'll carry this. Just turn around and come down backwards. Bit, yeah, because if you trip, you end up going head first. Yep. So you want to be going backwards so you scrape on your belly if you slide, but it's not too bad. That's it. Done. Uh, we have arrived at the ledge finally. Mel's just having a little breather. I'm going to set the tent up right here, right on the edge here. There's a bit of a safety margin there. And um, then I might see if I can catch some dinner. It's pretty wild out here at the moment. So I'll probably fish a bit higher and um, just fish briefly, see if I get dinner. If not, that's all good because we brought out some snacks. But tomorrow morning uh, looks really good. so. I'll focus most of my energy in fishing tomorrow morning instead. I've just got the medium outfit set up. I was going to use the heavy, which is in there, and I've broken one of the um, the guide ceramics or whatever. I fell over on the hike, so that would have been it. It was the guy, the this guide on the other rod was all bent, and there's no ring in it, so I can't use it. Just annoying, but um. We shall head down, 
set the rope up first put my pfd on first and then we'll run back up and grab the rod and clip go up and see if we can get something for dinner quickly hectic i'm gonna fish just there It is so windy down there. Haven't had any bites yet, but I've just got a uh, bit of squid I'm gonna throw and I can't bother doing a bait rig. And all the sinkers I brought were for my heavy rod. So a couple of casts of this and then I'm just gonna call it because it's not pleasant. And tomorrow morning should be much nicer. Morning. I did not catch anything yesterday. So, I've just got to retie an FG, put some burley in. I'm going to give it another shot. I'm still half asleep. Just got up. Um, no, it's windy now. There's more swell than I expected, which is annoying. I was going to try to get Mel onto a jewfish or snapper, but not feeling 100%, so. And it's kind of a bit sketchier than I expected, so we might leave it for another time. Much longer later than yesterday. Got a plaque on. Hey darling, I got you a present. Yes. Am I recording? Yep. All right, cool. I shall head down and catch a fish. I've rigged up the heavy. This guide fell out on the walk because I stacked it, but it doesn't have any sharp edges, so I'm going to risk it. And I'll either catch a fish or I'll hook up a big fish and lose it and regret it. Um, yeah, we're going to go with some bait because I've just lost my jig, all my plastic. After only three casts, I just got snagged and. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Far out, I just grabbed it. <sighs> Hope this is a snapper. Oh. Yeah, 
finally got a fish. Very slow start. Yeah, I'll bring it over here. Hooked him up and I could feel rocks straight away so I just went as hard as I could. The guide on the rod held up, fortunately. Doesn't have any sharp edges so I thought it might be alright, but not ideal. We got fish. That's our food before we hike out. So, how good is that? Be in the 80s I reckon. Maybe crack a 90. Solid fish. Got the poor thing bleeding and dead in the shade. Cool. We're going to have one more cast. Uh, one more cast, see if I can get anything. And then after that, we're going to cook up a bit because Mel's starving. Me too. We didn't have a proper dinner last night. And, um, and then we'll head on. Dinner is served, nearly. Fresh as it's gonna get, this will be our breakfast. Well, there's no blood. This is why you carry a first aid kit. Filleting, slipped, a hole through the sock, and a slice right there. You know, I've never cut myself with a filleting knife. <laughs> um, on location <laughs> until today. Uh, there's always got to be a first, doesn't there? What are you doing with that? Oh, I'm going to make it a big, like, pad. Nurse Mel on the job. Are my toes going to fall off after this? No. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, you've done your, um, you've done a fair few first aid courses, haven't you? Yeah. Have we got a boat? Fishing right there. <laughs> Get away from my fish. I don't know if there's any butterfly clips in there, but. Alright, onwards with the filleting, eh? Pull yeah, I'll up. pull that up. Yeah. Two fills. I will take off. A nice portion up here, and that will be what we will eat. That will be quite a lot to eat. I'll set the wings off, might as well. That's a look at the meat on that, so much meat. Mm. All right, I'm gonna bag it up, try to rinse my hands, and we will. Um, I'm going to have to literally hold it while I cook. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. Do you want to cook them both? You eat that much? Yeah, you're pretty hungry. Okay. We had nuts for dinner though. <laughs> we literally had almonds. Yeah. yeah, what's wrong with that? I wasn't even hungry last night. No, I was pretty tired to get hungry. Yeah, exactly. We've got cupy and salad. And a piece of plastic between my teeth.
that's a slab. I tried to cut them evenly, but it ain't even. We can do like the barbecue wings and the steak, one steak between us and the wings between us or something one night could be quite nice. Yeah. Reef and beef. Seems to be alright. No, it falls over, I'm picking it up and picking it anyway. I put that in my first aid kit because then it goes in everywhere. The plate was the plate was going to be the fry pan, but uh, the pieces aren't even, so this one's cooked. And this is five star. This is five star for sure. Five star restaurant. First bit of food since we've been here. We started eating nuts for dinner last night. <laughs> You don't sound happy about the nuts for dinner. They were good. They were good nuts. How's that? Well, amazing. I can't believe you asked if I could eat all that. Go on, mate. Are you serious? I could eat like that piece is twice the size of that. I could eat that piece and. My piece. You're that hungry. How's the slab? Sorry, babe, I'll let you have some. Thanks, babe. <laughs> no, I'm actually full. Really? I don't believe you. No, I am. No. Don't believe you. Alright, we're gonna garnish it. Yeah. This is how you garnish it. The way you said it, I was like... It's so garnished. Garnish snapper. Alright, cream it up. Oh yeah. <laughs> bon appetit. Bon appetit. Let's see. Just a nice little stroll to catch one snapper and eat it on the ledge. But anyway, we've got plenty to take home. Oh yeah. Don't want that bit. All right, we're done here. I'm gonna eat this, pack everything up, still got the ropes down there, and uh, hike out. We still got a few more days of camping and exploring, so might make another video, I'm not sure. I think we're gonna chill out a bit after this trip. This one's a bit hectic and I've got an injury and Mel's not feeling flash, so. Also, don't forget, I got some shirts if you want to grab one. I'm, oh yeah, around the back shot. I'm running low on some of the sizes, which seem to be the more popular sizes, so I'm probably going to chuck them on discount. Um, so if you want to snatch one up for a discounted price, go for it, and then I'll um, get another batch done soon, hopefully. Cheers for watching anyway, see you next time.